what's going on youtube right now i'm about to do a vlog style video one of my first ones and the thing is that you know right now we have more time to be at home so i said you know what let me show youtube what i'm working on i'm working on a video because uh i'm starting to do customs and i was like you know what before i do the other one before i do before i finish doing this one let me let me record you know i'm gonna do a time lapse maybe of this one i have some footage already of this one right here and i will post it but i was like let me do more footage for this side right here this see this shoes right here came out of nowhere it was an idea that i was like you know what i got some white bands i have i hadn't even used as you can see they still got the tag they were just chilling in my closet so i decided to go to um what you call that place it's not hobby lobby it's the other one michael's and i was like okay let me see if i can find some paint so i ended up buying the 48 piece acrylic paint see i was using this one a lot that's why it's out but i ended up buying this one everything was everything guys was half off this right here this right here cost 68 dollars but since they were closing down the stores and everything going on right now, they were like, you know what? We have a half hour special. So I bought all of this right here for $30, I believe. So yes, we are doing vlogs now on this channel. I wanna show you guys how easy it is that, you know, you can make your own customs, okay? And you can make a lot of money. People want customs right now in this economy right now. People wanna have their own custom gear. You know, if you if you have upcoming artists, they wanna be rocking what nobody else has and stuff like that, you know? And you know, it's a learning experience. I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to make some badass shoes like this one's right here. Come on guys, this one's looked like they could, like they're original, like they came from Vans. They, they don't even look like I painted them, right? It's not that hard guys, I'm gonna show you, okay? It's not that hard. For it to look professional, all you have to do is mask everything you don't want the paint on, right? like this right here. The little uh, thing right here. And you know what? I wanna keep this area clean, so I masked it off. Masking tape, come on guys, it's not that expensive. I have the masking tape right here. Right here. Uh, I believe uh, Family Dollar has a little section where you can buy tape like that, masking tape. Anyways guys. These ones right here were inspired by Monopoly. I started, I wanted something that had like vibrant colors. So I was like, hmm, what can I do with this kind of like teal color, this greenish, whatever it is right here. And I got thinking, well, there's this game, right? By the name of Monopoly. And I was like, yes, let's go for that idea. So you know what? I got, I got less, I, I did less talking and more action, right? So guys, right here, as you can see, I took the little man, the Monopoly man, and you know, I circled him right here. So I wanted some area to still remain white. Right here on the side, I just did some iconic, you know, uh, little, you know, little pieces that the game has. So this one was created by me. I know the game doesn't have guns like that or this kind of gun, but you know what? I was like, let me add my own little touch to this. And so I did. Money bag, I still have to work on this money bag right here. A little more detail is going to go into this right here on the back part of the shoe i might or might not leave it like that i don't want i don't see i don't want to overdo the shoe so i'm still thinking of should i put something there or not moving to the inner side of your this is a left shoe right here moving to the inner side i had this awesome idea i was like okay first of all if you ever watched robin big back in the day on mtv they had a little shared clothing brand with like a bunch of guns, like a bunch of gun designs on it. I think the name of that clothing brand was by, it was called Rock Status or something like that. And I always loved, loved that print. So I was like, let me bring it back. I'm gonna bring back that little gun print. So I looked up AK-47 uh, outline. And then once I found it on Google, I, I copied the image and saved it and I opened it on Word. And then when I opened it, I made it to about one and a half inches. And then I printed it out on the little piece of paper. 
Uh, this is uh, the outcome right here. And yes, guys, I filled it up with pen. If you want to do a better job, you can airbrush it in. But since I don't have airbrush, I did it with pen. It's much easier, much cleaner when you do it with airbrush. But hey, look at this. It didn't even come out bad at all. And you know, you will need a little blade or exacto knife. I didn't have one, so I took this one for my for my job. I work over there at the body shop, so we have a lot of these laying around. Uh, you can buy these like at O'Reilly's Auto Parts. They have them. These are very sharp. You need to be careful of them. Uh, any, I mean, I got you know a bunch of colored shoelaces because I'm planning on selling these with a bundle of uh, colored shoelaces. I'm gonna sell them with probably this ones right here. Uh, red and the pink ones and I might include the original white ones too and I'm gonna package them on little bags and hang them right here just like the Jordans come so that's my own little taste I just want to do that you know I'm gonna sell them with extra stuff and so right here on the other side I just got inspired I put a goal right there and right here it says collect your dreams and go right and I'm gonna color it in inside here is gonna be uh red the circle is going to remain white over here it's going to be the same color uh as far as this area right here i'm gonna do something similar to this but not the same i want it to be like really uh something that you know i don't know i just don't want to have like a regular shoe out there i want something that is going to catch people's eyes right because that's what we want right here something that hasn't been created before okay so that's what I'm gonna be working on, guys. I'm gonna show you how easy it is. It's not that hard at all. Okay, you're gonna start doing your own project to watch. Stop buying from these people. They're selling them $200, okay? If I sell these guys, I'm gonna probably sell them for like $110. And then, I mean, depending on how business goes, either less or more, whatever. You can buy Vans for like $50, $60, or even less if you got like a special going on. I know a lot of stores have that, uh, buy one and get half off special and you can still make money if i if i decide to sell these for 125 dollars later on i mean it's easy money but don't don't go buy them from nobody for 200 dollars, guys come on come on really anyways let's get this video started i'm gonna put the camera somewhere right here and we're gonna get the camera rolling and going okay all right guys
So guys, this right here was the end result. Don't be afraid. Uh, you're more than welcome to rate them from one to 10. All input is good input. Overall, I'm very, very pleased with how these came out. This was exactly the color wave I was going for. And uh, I could not be more happy with the way they came out. Super clean, I like them. Very fun to do. It's not over the top and it's not too less, it's just right enough. I mean, look at them. This will be for sale. As soon as my website goes up, I will be posting them over there. These are a size, I believe 10 and a half. Yeah, 10 and a half. And uh, brand new, never worn. Like I said, when the website is up, I will be posting them. What you guys think? I think they're heat, man. I'm about to do another uh, custom right now, right here on the SPs. Size eight, I'm about to do the same thing, but different design. By, by, by the same thing, I mean, I'm about to go crazy, guys. So keep in tune with the channel. Make sure you come back and see what I'm up to. All right, guys, take care now.